Hi, it's Bill Carter for Straight Circle Martial Arts. This is how you improve your back fist. So we've all done standard back fist, which requires this right here to snap back and forth. It's okay, but it's not nearly as powerful as it could be. If you learn to relax a little bit, it'll actually be more. I'm going to show you how to do it. So what happens is, is most people go like this on one plane. And that's okay. If you do it a little better, what happens is, is you'll find it goes like this and there's a little roll in this elbow. And then it straightens back out. It's like this. I'm going to make it big so you can see it. It's almost like, like a wave, right? And if you do it smaller, like it's got a lot of crack to it because you got that extra joint to create a little more snap on it. Also, because it's more relaxed, you can find different ways to throw it and sneak them into holes you normally couldn't do if you were very tense. So if we come in like this, and my hands are here, and my elbow's here, this just little roll like this is what makes this happen. We come in, I can roll that hand, boom. I always want to make sure when I throw this that there's that to it, just a little bit. And you would not believe how much crack that end next to that shot. It's just here and there. So when I do this, a lot of times as I come in, I will just take this up a little, little before I throw it. Instead of going like this stiff and just going like this. So you want to wave it. And it can be done very small and very effective. Now, keep in mind there are two back fists, right? There's open hip, closed hip. There's the quicker back fist where my hip closes so I can snap it and snap it back. Like that. It's just bang, like that, right? Then there's the other back fist, whereas if I came this way and I wanted to close the hips, I'd drive down in like this. Uh, different work. One is meant for quicker, more precise shots, but even then, if you add that roll to it, it's got a lot of juice on it. The other one is more I was here and my hips are this way, and I just want to use this to turn and throw it. Like that and it sets up my next work. You know, back fist to me is not an opening, or it's not a finishing shot. Generally, it's an opening shot. We get tied up, I don't like it, I throw it. It's very hard for them to see, especially if you cross this way. If I'm here, right, your brain expects this. Your brain expects this. Your brain does not expect things to come from sides, generally. So a lot of times, if you can slip it in, they won't even see it. Also, a back fist is not like points bar. We're not out here going like this and touching. This thing's close. I want to be here. I want the knuckles. I want to be into the neck. One, two, and then whatever I'm going into. So make sure you close. Stay relaxed. Because if he gives me a crap, he gives me a little push on it, right? I got to be able to wheel around this. He gets, I have to be able to wheel around it. See, like, I collapse and let it go. And there's the shot. So, relaxation, whip, find circles, stay very close. Thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe. It helps the channel immensely.